Today I'm in Sydney, Australia. I'm actually right in front of Bronte Beach. And this morning we'll run from Bronte Beach to Bondi Beach, a very famous surfing beach, beyond Bondi to the stink pipe and back. So it should be a good run and a beautiful day. I'm gonna be running along the coastal walk and there is a, a, an event called Sculpture by the Sea. And even though it's just a little after 7 a.m., it's gonna be crowded. So a little crowded running, but a beautiful scenic run along the beach. is the beach called Tamarama and it's the beginning of the sculpture walk along the coastal walk. Uh, you see maybe you can see behind me there a huge frying pan in sand. Uh, this is a temporary installation and actually today's the last day and so I'm trying to get out early because it's gonna get really busy. So uh, you can see here along the way is uh, behind me is the, are the cliffs. The coastal walk goes all along the cliffs from here to Bondi Beach. like uh, the sculpture walk by the sea is pretty popular today it's the last day and I think everybody waited to the last day so uh, I think you're running just a bit tough but uh, I'm weaving my way in and out and uh, if you like I'll show you some of the photos of the sculptures all the way some are really creative um, and you can see it's it's really a big hit so there's lots and lots of my mates out for a walkabout this morning and uh, hopefully I can just find enough room to run through them all without breaking any babies or anything like that. So uh, I'll continue on towards Bondi Beach and the stink hole. Or stink pipe. Stink pipe. <laughs>
I've made it to the stink pipe up here on this hill. Uh, it's called the stink pipe because it used to be the stink pipe. It was part of a water treatment plant up here and I guess they figured if they put a big pipe up in the air then the stink would go out over the ocean and nobody would smell it. Uh, today it's a golf course and uh, some of these golfers have been kind of aiming at me, so I don't think I'm going to go all the way up to the sink pipe because uh, I don't really don't want to interrupt their game. Uh, but from, oh, yeah, they're yelling at me. I, I better move. <laughs> ah, okay, so run to the sink pipe. <sighs> you know, I've, I've run in a lot of different cities around the world, and I don't usually run to sink pipes, but. Um, I usually run to city centers, things like that. We get a little story about the city, something uh, interesting. Uh, but this trip, I'm in Sydney, I'm by the beach. And so uh, running to the beach in the most prominent, uh, prominent landmark on the beach is the stink pipe. So thought it would be a good goal. And it's about three miles from the house I'm staying at in Bronte to the stink pipe. And it'll be three miles back. So nice little run and uh, I'm sure it'll be even more crowded along the coastal walk uh, with the sculptures by the sea. But I'll try to work my way through on the way back. One of the really neat things about Sydney Harbor and the beaches around Sydney is that at all the beaches, there are pools. And uh, as you might be able to tell, with the seawater coming in, they're, sea, they're uh, saltwater pools. And uh, Bondi actually has two pools, one at each end. You might have seen the other pool uh, in an earlier video clip. But uh, isn't that cool? What a great lifestyle. You know, in, in the video, I'm also trying to show the uh, people running, doing exercises. Uh, very active, very uh, physical, active outdoor lifestyle, and uh, with the lifeguards and the little nippers getting trained from a young age, I think it really instills that uh, great, healthy, active lifestyle from a very early age. So, uh, this is a 50 meter pool right along the ocean, and uh, there's a pool at Bronte as well. So, I just might jump in there when I'm done. So it's it's just it's just a cool thing. That's the end of the run from Bronte Beach to the Stink Pipe and back. Uh, about six mile run. Really nice day. A little crowded on the coastal walk, but uh, beautiful run. Uh, six mile run, it's about the longest I've ever run in about the last year. So it's been a long time since I did a video. It's a long time since I've been uh, running this much, but I've really enjoyed my stay here. In Australia I've been running almost every other day and uh, with all the other people out running and being fit it's really uh, motivational and uh, really such a beautiful spot and I'm glad to be out here running again hope you enjoy the video I've had an ultra life time and I hope you have an ultra life too
off of the Sydney Harbour Bridge. <laughs>